Welcome to ReneEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Join us on this channel to explore inspiring projects for a sustainable tomorrow. We bring you the latest in renewable energy, sustainability, and cutting-edge technologies. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. One of the most remarkable advancements in green hydrogen production without desalination comes from a pioneering study at the University of Adelaide. This research represents a major leap forward in seawater electrolysis technology, a method that could revolutionize hydrogen production on a global scale. The ability to directly use untreated seawater to split hydrogen from oxygen without desalination is groundbreaking, addressing one of the most significant challenges in clean energy production, the need for large volumes of fresh water. Hydrogen is seen as a cornerstone of the global transition to clean energy. It is a versatile fuel that can power a range of applications, from fuel cells in vehicles to industrial processes that are difficult to decarbonize. Traditionally, hydrogen has been produced through the electrolysis of water, a process that splits H2O into hydrogen and oxygen using an electrical current. However, this process requires highly purified water, which poses a challenge for widespread hydrogen production, particularly in regions where freshwater is scarce. The reliance on purified water is a significant issue, given that many parts of the world already face water scarcity. Coastal regions and island nations, for instance, have abundant seawater but limited access to freshwater resources. In these locations, desalination has been the traditional method for obtaining the necessary pure water for electrolysis. But desalination is an energy-intensive process that adds complexity and cost to hydrogen production, making it less attractive for large-scale use. The University of Adelaide research team has tackled this problem head-on by developing a seawater electrolysis system that eliminates the need for desalination altogether. This breakthrough could unlock vast new sources of hydrogen by using the planet's virtually limitless seawater supply, opening the door to massive clean energy production without straining precious freshwater resources. At the heart of this breakthrough is the use of a nanostructured bifunctional catalyst. The team created an advanced material using cobalt oxide with a surface layer of chromium oxide, a non-precious and relatively inexpensive compound. This catalyst is the key to the system's success. Traditional electrolysis using untreated seawater has been hindered by the presence of chloride ions, from salt, that cause side reactions, such as the formation of chlorine gas. Chlorine gas is highly corrosive and can damage the electrolysis equipment, reducing efficiency and increasing operational costs. The catalyst developed by the Adelaide team solves this issue by selectively promoting the oxygen evolution reaction, OER, while suppressing the chlorine evolution reaction, CER. This is achieved by carefully structuring the material at the nanoscale. The nanostructuring increases the catalyst's surface area, providing more active sites for the electrolysis reactions. More importantly, it allows for fine-tuning of the material's electronic properties, optimizing it for splitting water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen while avoiding the unwanted production of chlorine gas. The researchers achieved nearly 100% efficiency with their system, which is comparable to commercial electrolyzers that rely on expensive platinum and iridium catalysts, using highly purified water. This is a significant achievement, as it demonstrates that seawater can be used as a direct feedstock for hydrogen production without compromising on performance. Moreover, the Adelaide team system is not only efficient but also highly stable. In tests, the catalyst was shown to be able to operate continuously for over 100 hours without any degradation, maintaining current densities of 500 mA per square centimeter at a voltage range between 1.87 and 2.3 volts. These current densities and voltages are competitive with existing commercial systems, indicating that this technology could be scaled up for real-world applications. One of the standout features of this system is that it requires no pretreatment of the seawater. Most electrolysis systems using seawater first require desalination, which involves removing salt and other impurities from the water. This adds an extra step to the process, making it more expensive and less efficient. The Adelaide team's method bypasses this by directly splitting seawater without the need for reverse osmosis, deionization, or any other purification steps. This is a significant economic advantage, as desalination is one of the most costly and energy-consuming parts of hydrogen production in regions where seawater is the primary water source. By removing this step, the Adelaide system not only reduces costs but also makes the process much simpler and more scalable. 
the implications of this breakthrough are immense. First, it could enable coastal regions and island nations to produce hydrogen at scale without tapping into freshwater reserves. This is particularly important for countries like Australia, which has abundant access to seawater and renewable energy resources like wind and solar power. Australia is positioning itself as a global leader in green hydrogen production, and this new technology could give it a significant competitive edge. Additionally, this technology could help address the global water crisis by reducing the need for freshwater and hydrogen production. As climate change exacerbates water scarcity in many parts of the world, finding ways to produce clean energy without using freshwater will be critical. The University of Adelaide team's research is still in its early stages, but they have already begun scaling up their system for larger applications. The next step is to integrate this technology into commercial electrolyzers, which could be used to power fuel cells, ammonia production, and other industrial processes that require hydrogen. The team also envisions the creation of offshore hydrogen production facilities, where seawater could be electrolyzed directly using renewable energy from offshore wind farms and solar plants. If successful, this system could pave the way for a global green hydrogen economy powered by seawater and renewable energy. It offers a solution to the twin challenges of water scarcity and carbon emissions, providing a path forward for countries looking to transition to clean energy without further depleting their natural resources. In conclusion, the University of Adelaide's development of a nanostructured bifunctional catalyst for seawater electrolysis represents a game-changing breakthrough in green hydrogen production. By eliminating the need for desalination and using an inexpensive, non-precious catalyst, this technology could dramatically reduce the cost and complexity of hydrogen production, making it more accessible to countries around the world. With further research and scaling, this system has the potential to revolutionize the way we produce hydrogen, helping to usher in a new era of clean energy powered by one of the most abundant resources on Earth, seawater. Thanks for tuning into the ReneEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoy the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.